My name is Anthony Mataloni, and I'm going to talk about how to become a sports photographer. Sports photography is the type of photography that you're obviously, it's, it's along the lines of event photography. And you're going to need a certain amount of equipment to do sports photography that is specialized. You're going to need a zoom lens, and you're going to need a lens which is a pretty fast lens, essentially a lens that you can capture action with. So you want something where your f-stop range is pretty good, okay? That means your aperture is from maybe 4 upwards to 11. It's more of a technical thing with sports photography. You're also going to want to think about how do I remain, how do you remain unobtrusive? Sports photography is something where you're really away from the action and you're just there photographing. You want to think about what one of these players is more a star. Who's, who do I want to concentrate on? Because sometimes you might have up to you know, 30, 40 people potentially on the field. And that's something as being a sports photographer you really have to think about. In terms of making money at sports photography, the best way probably to start off would be a high school or a middle school going into these games and literally just trying to get permission to photograph. A lot of times there will be people under the age of 18. Very important that you get permission from parents. You can't just show up with a camera and take pictures of kids. It's not a good idea. You want to talk to people. You want to promote yourself. And it can be pretty lucrative actually. People love photographs of their kids playing sports. It can be excellent. But you got to remember there's a lot of people that might want to do that type of photography to make money. So you have to have an engaging personality. A certain amount of patience is involved. You're dealing with kids, you know. Kids are, are you know, they're sensitive. You want to talk to them. You want to get to know them a little bit. If you do that, I can almost guarantee you will be successful starting out as a sports photographer. And then from there, again, get a good portfolio together. Bring your portfolio to certain people around town who run, you know, it could be from boxing to hockey, anything. And that's how I would become a sports photographer.